what in my opinion is one of the most affordable must have beginner niche fragrances on the market of course i'm talking about mancera citrat boise stay tuned So before we get down to business, I do want to say this will be a full bottle giveaway at the end of the video. We're going to take care of a little business and talk about this fragrance first. Then I want to have a little quick discussion with you guys here at the end. So let's get into this presentation. So standard Mancera box. It's the black box, not the gold. It has the same label that is on the bottle. Name, size and concentration. Nothing on the top, nothing on the sides batch code and fragrance information on the bottom more fragrance information on the back come with these bags as well some have a gold bag this one has this graphite colored bag that goes with the theme of the cap they are pretty cool little drawstring bags into this bottle very iconic bottles they look great on the shelf they stack very well together like i was saying before has that gunmetal kind of gray color mancera m on the top same label that's on the box batch information fragrance information on the bottom so the older style they do screw on the newer style they have magnetic caps i love the screw on style and then decent atomizer nothing real special but it definitely does the trick let's get into the scent so this is not an overly complex heavily nuanced scent when you smell cidrat boise put those notes right there for you you're getting a lot of fruits and a lot of woods. Black currant, very dominant in the opening, does hold true throughout most of the life of the fragrance until you're left with just that woody dry down. But in the opening, you're going to get a heavy dose of the black currant, and you're going to get a lot of the fruits that's seen in this note breakdown. It doesn't specify, specify what fruits, but it's a very, very fruity opening and heart and transitional phase for sure in this fragrance. And I find as far as the woods, the cedar seems to be most dominant off of my skin to my nose. It's not one where you get a lot of the sweetness from the vanilla or I don't get a lot of the musk. I do get an undertone of muskiness, but it's not real heavy and in the forefront. It's predominantly black currant fruits and cedar is predominantly what I smell on this one. A lot of people like to compare it to Aventus. Well, it doesn't smell like Aventus. It gives off a similar vibe to Aventus. This definitely has the Aventus vibe and it's much, much cheaper than Aventus. Places like Kingdom Fragrances, which is always linked down below, you can get around 73 bucks for a 120 ml bottle. Same thing with Vimper Fragrances. It's right around the same price, maybe a few dollars more. Link down below as well. It's easy to get a hold of. There's usually a pretty good stock. The smell is incredible on this one. It's high quality, but not the highest quality niche fragrance out there. It's definitely a step above what you're used to with designer fragrances. You can tell this isn't just a run of the mill. This isn't a Dolce & Gabbana fragrance. This isn't a Dior fragrance. This isn't a Versace fragrance. You will smell the differences for those that are newer to fragrances or really starting to get into the hobby and you're used to wearing designer fragrances, this doesn't have as much of a synthetic smell as you're going to get from those designer fragrances. This is much higher quality oils. Is it, like I said before, is it the highest quality out there? No, but it's definitely much higher quality than your typical designer fragrances. Scent on this is gorgeous. It's pretty much a must have. It's kind of the go-to niche fragrance when you're wanting to start diving into the niche brands scent on this one's going to get an 8.5 out of 10. now longevity it's kind of a mixed bag but religiously i get about nine hours on my skin i had a decant before i had a bottle which was a totally different batch it was a much older batch than this and in this bottles from end of last year so late 2019 batch i don't remember exactly i'll put the Anybody that's interested in looking up the batch code, there you go. I get nine hours every time I wear it, you know, and I tend to refresh a little bit before that, except for when I initially did some testing, when I originally wrote this review in my little notepad forever ago. I've been meaning to do this review. And 
Some people complain they get less. Sorry that your skin drinks this stuff, but I know for a lot of people, it's a pretty good performer. It's a, is it a, a mega beast mode fragrance? No, but it's a pretty long lasting fragrance in my experience. And for longevity, it's gonna get another 8.5 out of 10. Now projection, it's no slouch in that category either. For the first three hours, it's about an arm's length, few feet out. Um, the first hour being a little bit more than that. It actually pushes pretty well off of my skin. It's a little bit above average early on to about average for a few hours more. You will smell yourself very easily with this. This has a very strong compliment factor as well. That's one of the reasons it's so popular. It's affordable on the gray market from discounters. It's versatile. This is a four season signature scent worthy year round type of fragrance. The projection is solid. The longevity is great. Projection on this one's going to get an eight out of 10. Overall, Cidrapoise from Mansara, in my opinion, is absolutely an 8.5 out of 10 fragrance. This is, like I said, it's a go to. This is one of those fragrances that people get recommended when they're wanting to start to dive into niche. This is a great beginner niche fragrance. It really is. And even for the enthusiast that has 50 niche fragrances and has four and $500 bottles, this is still a very easy reach for a lot of people. A lot of people wear this fragrance. It's extremely popular and for very good reason. Like I said a moment ago, it's extremely versatile. It's year round signature scent worthy. It dresses up, it dresses down. You can do everything with Cedrat Boise. It's a wonderful, beautiful, must-have fragrance. Now let's get into this giveaway. So first and foremost, thank you so much everybody. I just eclipsed 20,000 subscribers. It has been an amazing journey thus far. The ups, the downs, the all-arounds, the changing of the settings, the different lighting setups, the different room setups. It's, there's a, things that have changed, different thumbnails, all that, but what's remained the same is how much I love doing these videos for you guys. And it still overwhelms me and still humbles me greatly that so many people want to watch me talk about fragrances. This is just a hobby and a passion for me. I love fragrances. I love talking about fragrances. And it's just awesome that so many of you reach out and I, I, all day long I'm having conversations, reading comments, responding to comments. I love it guys. And for the most part, most of you keep it pretty classy, and I do appreciate that. I love that about you guys. This is truly turned into a family. That's why all my coupon codes are TLTG family, because it is a family, in my opinion. And as a thank you to my family, I want to give one person a shot at getting a sealed bottle of Mansara Cedrat Boise. I did pick this up the other day. It was in my haul video. I bought it specifically for whenever I hit the milestone so I can give it away to you guys. So as always, we're gonna have to go ahead and like, comment, subscribe, like this video, make sure you're subscribed to the channel. No, I'm not gonna make you follow me on, on Instagram. I had a couple people complain about that because they're not on Instagram. Not all giveaways are gonna be like that. This one's not like that. And we're gonna do the usual, TLTG, I'm in. That's all you gotta put in the comment and you will be entered to win. I will let this run for four days, I will announce, I'll pin the winning comment in this video, respond to it that alerts the person who won, and I will announce it in a community post on my community page. Good luck to everybody. Thank you so, so much. This, this is just a small token of my appreciation. Thank you guys. On to the next milestone. Let's keep this thing going. I'm loving it. I'm glad you're loving it too. And until next time, I will say, get your hands on Mansara said Drap Boise, and you give it a spray now, you might end up thanking me later. One person's gonna win a bottle. Good luck, everybody. Mm -hmm.